A woman in Corning is a recent graduate from Elmira College who will be walking to receive her diploma in June. She's also a Marine Corps veteran, but was told she will not be allowed to wear military honor cords at the ceremony. Joining us now is WNY's Isabel Garcia, who sat down with Morgan Reed to find out how the situation happened. Hello there, Logan. Morgan Reed is looking for answers as to why Elmira College has denied her the ability to show her military pride during a graduation ceremony where she feels pride should be center stage. After asking the Veterans Association representative at Elmira College how to go about getting veteran honor cords, Morgan found a disappointing answer. She said she didn't know anything about it, so she would ask some questions, and she came back and told me that the registrar, Michael Halperin, said no, only honor cords are allowed. Surprised by the response, Morgan asked the VA rep if there was a miscommunication. After several days without a response, she decided to take the situation into her own hands. I took it upon myself to go to the source last night. I emailed him and asked him if he could explain further, and he said, we only honor, honor courts, um, and that that's what this commencement ceremony was for, that I was not allowed to wear my veteran cord. Elmira College's website only lists academic honors under commencement activities, but Morgan says she feels being a part of the Marine Corps is greater than a duty. Well, the fact that he used only honor cords, are, that was a huge honor for me to be able to serve my country. Served my country, I served those people so they could go to school safely, um, almost for no reason, like I, he wasn't proud of what I did. The Marine Corps veteran also feels strongly about the situation because of her ability to even attend a private college. And I think that that day kind of is about me also because I wouldn't be at his rather expensive private college if it weren't for my GI Bill and all of the GI Bill payments that um, were given to Elmira College. They made a lot of money off of me. Now, WEY has reached out to Elmira College after office hours for a response, but have not received an answer at this time. We will bring you that information as soon as it's provided. For now, reporting in the studio, Isabel Garcia, WENY News.